Facebook. Welcome back. This is Kelly with Back to Nature Wildlife Refuge. And today we are going to introduce you to a fox squirrel. Yes, that is right. I said a fox squirrel. And not only do they have this fox-like tail, have a little bit of a musky odor like a fox, but these guys are the largest species of squirrel in the entire state of Florida. I bet you guys haven't seen one before, have you? This is Roxy, and Roxy is our resident Sherman's fox squirrel. She has been with us for a little over four years when she was rescued as a baby. Now we take in over 800 squirrels a year as rehab patients that we release back into the wild, but very rarely do we get fox squirrels. So another facility actually had Roxy, and even they only had but one fox squirrel that year. Unfortunately, it's really hard to raise any wild animal by itself. So as a result, Roxy imprinted on humans. So as you can see, Roxy has very little fear of people and is almost too comfortable being around us. Now it's taken us four years to get Roxy to the state that she's in now where she won't actually try to bite us, but instead she's okay with hanging out. We've learned our boundaries, haven't we? Roxy is one of our most important educational ambassadors, and that is because she is an imperiled species. With their habitat loss and the population decreasing, it's really important that people know about them. So Roxy actually visits schools. So we know that squirrels really love acorns, but fox squirrels also really love pine nuts and pine cones. So when they find their food, just like any squirrel, they're gonna bury that food. Now sometimes what they'll do when they bury that food is they'll forget about it and then a tree can grow. So we can actually say that our squirrels are responsible for some of our forests. So when a squirrel lies sprawled out like this, it's usually an indication that they're hot. They call this pancaking, and it helps them cool their body down by flattening themselves on their tummy. We really hope you guys enjoyed meeting Roxy today. Thanks so much for tuning in, and we'll see you next time.